Hello, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to talk you through some basics of Photoshop. I did record myself creating these adverts that you can see um, and sort of working through how I got to them, but they were just taking too long. The videos were about 25 minutes long and I thought to myself, um, it's a bit boring really. So I thought what I would do is I would just show you the key skills and I'll probably break it down into some smaller videos. So I'm going to focus on uh, for this video is basically um, removing a background, be it from a photograph, a logo or your text. And there's a couple of different methods that we can use to do that. OK, so first things first, I'm just going to create a solid gradient. Um, you don't need this, but I'm just going to use this for demonstration purposes. OK, so gradient tool over here, selected my colours and uh, depending on how you do your line depends on the kind of gradient you get so that's my gradient there i'm just going to move that to the bottom okay so first thing i'm going to show you is the logo and there's a couple of different things that we can do here in order to get rid of the white so first things first we can just use the magic wand tool click on the outside and just hit delete and that's just deleted all the white nice and easily and that's a really effective tool um, if it's a very solid colour. Okay, another way we can do that, if we wanted all these white bits to go, is we could go to Select Colour Range and we could click on the white. And as you can see now, this time round, there we go, as you can see, this time round it's selected everything. When we hit Delete, that all goes. So that's method number one, nice and easy to create your logo. Okay, next thing we can do then is we can look at the text. Now you could use the same methods for text, but what normally happens, and if I just show you quickly, what normally happens is you end up with a bit of a sort of a horrible outline. It just doesn't look that great. So for text, I tend to use a different method. I click on Layers, Multiply, and look at that. Perfect. If I click on Actual Pixels, you can see it's much better quality. There's no um, outline on it or anything like that. Okay. The final thing to do then is to remove the outline of this image here. So in order to do that, I'm going to use the quick selection tool and I can just simply draw around and hit delete. And that's really, really easy, isn't it? OK, so I can go around, I can do that. Now, if you take something you didn't want to do, you can hold down the alt button and simply colour it back in. And that's just going to repair anything that you didn't want to take away. OK, and then you can resize it and you can readjust it as you need. So here you can see I've taken away the background and I've taken away the text and I've done the same on this one. So that's skill number one, removing the background.